Hello, today we're going to do conditional statements in Visual Basic. Uh, first thing you need is just to create a basic form. You're going to need a text box, a label, and a button. Alright, first thing we're going to do, you can name these whatever you want, it doesn't really matter. First thing we're going to do is we're going to double click on the button. This will bring you to the main part of the button code, and the first thing we're going to go is uh, we're going to dim an integer. Hope you're okay with this. You just go dim amount is equal to the value of text box one dot text. That means whatever we enter in that text box that will be equal to the amount. Then we're going to go if amount is equal to 1 then we'll go label 1 equal 1. No label 1 dot text. There you go. Now you can either go like if amount is equal to 2, then you can do that again, but a more convenient way to do this is to just go here and then go else if. It's the exact same thing. It's a little bit more efficient. And then you go else. This means all other possibilities you want to equal. We'll just go error. So if you enter anything else besides one or two, it's just going to say error. So then when you play it, as you can see, if I enter in one, press the button, it's equal to one, two, it's equal to two, and if I enter in anything else, it's just going to say error. It doesn't matter what I enter, I can type in anything. <clears throat> because if it's equal to 1, it does this. If it's equal to 2, it does this. Or else, it does whatever that is. Alright, well, I hope you hope that helped you understand how to get text boxes and conditional statements. And thank you for watching my tutorial.